I'm Nina McVeigh. And I'm Jennifer Jiggis. Jennifer, I love to do crazy quilting. It's been an art form in the quilting world for over 100 years, and as I said, I love to do it. However, it takes so much time to do it traditionally, by hand. It really does take quite a bit of time. You have your piecing involved, and then all of your um, decorative stitch work, the embellishment, et cetera. It really can be a very time-consuming project, mm -hmm. uh, as beautiful as it is. So it's wonderful that there are so many techniques now where you can use your sewing machine, use your embroidery module to create very detailed things like this in a fraction of the time. And what we're going to do is actually do a block in the embroidery unit of the machine and we're going to piece and embellish all at the same time. Oh, that's a huge time saver. The first thing that's going to happen when we get to the hoop is the machine will sew out a five-sided placement line. We will then take our first piece of fabric and cover that five-sided placement line and let the machine stitch it down in place. So this is also a great technique to use up a lot of your scraps and small pieces of fabric and things that you have in your stash. Absolutely. Next, the machine will sew a placement line for our second piece of fabric. We will then lay our second piece of fabric about a quarter of an inch over that placement line, let the machine sew it down. After you've attached a piece of fabric, you will want to go in and trim away that excess fabric from underneath, and we will flip it out so it lays the way it will on the block. The machine will then embellish that seam for us so that we don't have to go back and do that by hand. Now position your next fabric, again so it's a quarter of an inch over that placement line. Again, trim away the excess and open that up. This might be a good time to insert a piece of lace. When you do that, you want to lay it down so again, it's just covering that stitching line. And then I like to go back in my embroidery and re-sew that line. We will continue around that five-sided shape, adding fabric and embellishment until the block is complete. So here's that finished block, and this is really a very cool technique. Well, not only is it a cool technique because it's fast and easy and mm -hmm. all done in the machine, but now I can get to the fun stuff like embellishing it, whether I choose to embellish it on the machine with other techniques or by hand. And so now this piece is simply four of the blocks stitched together. If you'd like to try this technique, you can visit www.BerninaUSA.com to download this design file. To learn more about embroidered crazy quilting, visit your local Bernina dealer today. Music